please, someone help me. Anybody? Somebody? Help me. Please, someone save me. I don't want to marry him. I can't marry him. Please, you have to help me. There's no time. Just trust me. How can I trust you? I don't even know who you are. What are you wearing? Uh, quickly, he's gonna find me, please. What? Thank you. You saved my life. Huh? Okay, mystery woman. Can I at least get your name? Giselle. Giselle Barker. Giselle Barker. Okay, look. I don't even know why you're in my car. I don't know who you're running from. There he is. He's coming. He's coming for me. Whatever you do, don't tell him I'm here. Hey. It's gonna be okay. Excuse me, sir. Have you seen this young woman anywhere around here? Just blonde. Picture this in a wedding dress. She couldn't have gone too far. Uh. Look, I'm willing to give you $10,000 if you help me find her. She's my wife. She didn't take her medication today. Look, she's a danger to herself and everyone else around her. Seriously? Yes. I need your help finding her. Look, $10,000 is a lot. Just tell me where she is. I actually do know where she is. Where? Show me the cash. Here. It's all yours. It smells amazing. Hello. Who the hell are you? I'm looking for a young woman. Would you have any reason to believe why this man might be hiding someone inside of his car? Are you an idiot? This is my boyfriend. Why would he do that? Now, get lost. By the way, sir, she went that way. Really? Mm-hmm. Hey, jerk. Oh my god, seriously, there are some seriously crazy people running around in this parking lot. <sighs> oh my god. Ah! Oh my god! Oh, what in the world? This is the girl he was talking about. Um, I, I had to lie to him. Look, I'm sorry, but this woman is in danger. Uh, do I look like a care? Get rid of her. Oh my gosh, she's seriously ruining my car for presents. Oh, please don't do this to me. It's Valentine's Day, have a heart. I just need a place to stay for a few days. <gasps> oh, bummer. <gasps> Maybe I should call that guy because I don't have a heart, right, Zach? No, you can't do this, Margo, seriously. Look, she's in danger and we have to help her. If you help her, we're over. Now get out, lady. And Zach, take my bags and put them in the trunk. Now. I'm sorry, Giselle. you in the truck. It's a short drive, but we have to go now. Are you sure? What about your girlfriend? Look, don't worry about her, but we have to go now. You'll be safe soon. God, Zach! You drive so slow. Men are supposed to drive fast, not slow like little scared losers like you! I I'm sorry! I love- Oh, shut it! Go to my truck now and get my bags because we all know that if you get them, you're going to take nine years to get into the house. Or better yet, be such a big wuss that you can't even carry them on your own. No, 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 listen, I'll, I'll take your bags. No, I'm no, going no, to get them. Sweetie, trust me, listen, listen, listen. You just got your nails done. I don't want you to ruin them. That's the only smart thing you said all day. You know what? You're right. Chop, chop, get the bags right now. We're here. Thank you for hiding me from Ronald. I really appreciate it. I, I gotta go. Ronald? Is his name? Yes. Thanks again. 
Hold on. But, I mean, we're, we're kind of close to the mall. I mean, if you continue running, he might find you. Why don't you come stay at my house? You've already done enough. Your girlfriend wouldn't like that. Look, she doesn't have to know. All right, now quickly, go through the side gate and climb into my room through the window. I'll distract her. Go. Uh, oh, go, okay. Go. God, what took so long, Zach? Did you fall on the way or something ridiculous? No, it's just a lot of bags to hold, sweetie. So, what's your point? Not manny enough to hold them? Anyway, I'm gonna go to my room to freshen up. No, why do you need to freshen up? Wait, you are fresh. You look fresh, you smell fresh. Yeah, I always look fresh. But I need to relax a bit. I shopped a lot. What do you mean by a lot? How much did you spend on my card? $10,000 for Valentine's Day. Oh, I got a Louis bag and Gucci boots and a uh, Chanel wallet. $10,000? Are you insane? That's like two months of my paycheck, Margo. Uh, it's Valentine's Day, so it's no big deal. Plus, if you have a problem with that, I can always dump your poor, pathetic self at any time. I am worth 100 times $10,000. Keep that in mind, Zach. Plus, you have to do what you have to do to keep me satisfied because clearly, I haven't been satisfied. Anyway, toodles. No, one second. Stop acting shady! Get out of my way! She can't know I'm here. Uh... Why are you following me? I wanted to spend more time with you, babe. It's Valentine's Day. No, I'm taking a nap. Hopefully I can dream about dating better guys than you. Ouch. Thank God. I was scared when I couldn't find you. Are you okay? Yes, I am. I'm just scared of your girlfriend. Honestly, me too. Look, let's get you out of here and get you something to drink. for this. This tastes amazing. Thank you. My girlfriend, she never appreciates the coffee I make for her. Listen, I don't know you very well, but your girlfriend seems like the type of person who doesn't appreciate anything. Why are you even with her? You know, it's, it's funny you ask that. I've been dealing with this for years now. And I don't even know who I am anymore. I, I feel terrible about myself all the time. I don't know why I'm still with her. I'm scared. I'm scared that I'll never find better or that I deserve better. Zach, you helped a stranger in need. You did everything you could and you don't even know me. You deserve the best. There aren't very many people in the world like you. You're special. I hope you know that. Wow! So adorable! Margo? I thought you were sleeping. Well, you thought wrong. Like, the little idiot you are. I wasn't sleeping. This whole time, ever since we left the stupid mall, I knew there was something wrong. You wouldn't let me take the bags out of the car. You took forever to get into the house. You wouldn't let me freshen up in my room. And guess what? My suspicions were right. You've been hiding a little runaway rat in this house the whole time! Don't call her that! She's a human being! Uh, a human being that's about to go back to wherever the heck she came from! I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to cause an issue between the both of you. It's fine, I'll just leave. No, Giselle! You can't leave. You little rascal. How dare you walk away from me on my wedding day? You robbed me of the happiest day of my life! You robbed me of my life! I hate you! I never wanted to be with you, and this is my chance to stand up for myself. For years, I put up with your crap. 
but no more. Shut up, Giselle. Come with me. No, she's not! Oh, yeah? What exactly are you gonna do about it, pal? This is your chance. You're not what Margot tells you you are. You're so much more. Come on, Zach! Stop! Come on, Giselle. Oh, what? You're, you're choosing her over me? Anybody but you, Margot. You have been the worst thing that's ever happened to me. I'm done. We're done. Find someone else to finance your life and tear them down. They can run. But they can't hide. He saved my life without even knowing me. She helped me stand up for myself. She was more there for me than Margot ever was. He made me realize that there still are good people out there in the world. All in the first day of meeting her. Could he be the one? Could she be the one? <laughs>